coming up on Sports Weekly. The Cajon Cowboys clinched at least a share of the Citrus Belt League title with a win versus Carter and will play for the outright title against Redlands East Valley this week. Plus, Redlands is gearing up for a showdown with Citrus Valley with a potential playoff spot on the line and also Grand Terrace, its first ever football league championship in the Sunkist. That's coming up on Sports Weekly. The Cajon Cowboys are on the verge of winning their first outright league title since 2010. Welcome to Sports Weekly. I'm Pep Fernandez. In 2015, Cajon split the Citrus Belt League title with Redlands East Valley, but seven years ago, the Cowboys were able to capture the San Andreas League crown by going a perfect 7-0 in league play. Well, Cajon has a chance to do it again this year, but in the CBL. The Cowboys already own at least a share of the league title, but they can clinch the outright championship with a win against Rev on Friday. Cajon is 8-1 overall as the Cowboys have climbed to number two in the latest CIF Southern Section Division Four rankings. That's the highest ranking for the Cowboys all season. So it's Cajon versus Rev on Friday as the Cowboys will look to cap off a perfect season in the CBL. Well, Redlands took on Miller in Week 9 as the Rebels played their final home game as a Citrus Belt League school. Miller, along with Indian Springs, will move to the Mountain Valley League next season. The Terriers won the game 47-12 as Redlands is pushing hard for the playoffs. They'll meet Citrus Valley in their final CBL game of the season, and a win against the Blackhawks could push the Terriers into the postseason. Yeah, you know, I, I think this uh, could be a playoff spot for either team. You know, they, they got some work to do. Um, you know, as the seasons are going on, the rivalry is going to build. Um, so we just, just got to make sure we're ready. We're going to get their best game. We know that. But we still need a lot of help. You know, we dug ourselves in a hole. Tonight was a great start. Come out strong. Um, I think we scored 21 points in the first quarter. Uh, and, and, and we took care of business tonight, and that's all we have to do. You know, we got to win one more game, and we'll see where it lands us. You know, uh, it's going to be tough to get in the playoffs. Just we, we, in Division 5. School history was made at Grand Terrace as the Titans football team won its first ever league title. Grand Terrace defeated Kaiser 50 to 14 to clinch the Sunkiss League Championship. The Titans finished league play this week against Bloomington with a chance to go 5 and 0 in the Sunkiss. Grand Terrace head coach Ryan Smalls, who's the older brother of Baltimore Ravens standout Jimmy Smith, who played at Colton High School, calls it a special season for the Titans. Nobody can ever do that again. <laughs> when you get the first one, there there never be another first one. So it was, you know, it's that feeling of you want to sit down and take it all in because uh, it's your first one, you know, hopefully first of many. But it was definitely a surreal feeling, and, and yes, I very much enjoyed it. Besides the kids, I think it's the coaching staff. Our coaching staff is phenomenal. The support that they give the kids. The, the focus and dedication that they, they have, I think that's really been the key. The kids, they do what the coaches ask, and the coaches are there to, to guide them, and it's not always about, you know, football. And I think that's one of the keys, is it's also their grades, also the want, also there's so many different things, and I think that the coaching staff is what kind of keeps the rails. You know, like when you, when you play uh, bowling, how you have those little those little bumpers on the side sometimes the, the coaches. It's the final week of the regular season and we will break it all down on Sports Weekly Live. It's your only place to catch all the scores and highlights. We're live every Friday night at 11 p.m. on IEMG and if you can't stay up late, it's okay. You can watch the show online anytime on the IE Media Group YouTube channel and be sure to subscribe. Well, thank you for watching Sports Weekly and be sure to check out all the shows and videos on the IE Media Group YouTube channel and hit that subscribe button and don't miss a minute of all the action. I'm Pep Fernandez and thank you for watching Sports Weekly on IEMG.